Hi there, this is Rebecca from the Bolshevik YMCA and today we're going to learn how to make a plastic skipping rope. All you're going to need are six plastic bags, masking tape, and scissors. To start off, we're going to cut three plastic bags into 15 strips. To do that, you're going to want to lay your plastic bag flat down on the ground and you're going to want to cut off the top end of the plastic bag and then you're also going to want to cut off the bottom end of the plastic bag. This will just leave you with a flat piece of plastic with a big hole in the middle. Once you've done that, you can cut this piece of plastic into five roughly equal pieces. They don't have to be exact. Your strips should look like this and you should be able to open them up a little bit. Once you have finished cutting up three plastic bags into 15 plastic strips, you should have something like this, which looks a little messy, but this is going to turn into this. We are going to knot together our plastic to make three equal chains. To knot together your plastic, you're going to want to take one plastic loop or strip and thread it through another plastic strip. You then take your second plastic strip, loop it through itself and lightly pull. You don't want to tug too hard so you don't break the plastic. You wanna continue looping plastic through each other until you have five strips of plastic. You can then move on to make your second chain of five strips of plastic and then your third chain of five strips of plastic. In the end, you should have a total of three knotted plastic chains. Once you have your three completed plastic chains, you want to make sure that you are ensuring that they are not tangled because we are gonna put these three plastic chains together by braiding them, which looks a little difficult, but it's not that bad. What you're gonna do is you're going to take the top of your three chains and you are going to knot them together, just like so. Once again, while you want a tight knot, make sure not to pull too hard or you may break the plastic. Once you have your knot secured, you can begin braiding your plastic chains from the top of the knot. To braid your plastic chains, just make sure you're folding over the outside pieces of plastic to the inside pieces of plastic and repeat on the other side. I would suggest putting something heavy on your knot so that it does not go flying and it keeps your braid tight. Once your braid is complete, it should look like this. Now, with the next three plastic bags, you need to repeat the process all over again. Just as a reminder, you're going to cut five strips from three plastic bags, tie together the strips to form three chains, five strips per chain, and then you're going to braid all the chains together. When all is said and done, you should have two plastic bag braids. We are now coming to the last few steps in our tutorial. You're gonna take the two braids that you made and join them together at one end. So you see here, I have two different ends of each braid and I am joining to them together using a piece of masking tape. I'm using green masking tape because this will actually eventually become one of the handles on your skipping rope. So if you have something a little bit more lively, that would be fantastic. Once you have secured the two ends of your braids together, you're gonna intertwine them by twisting the braids together until the two opposite ends meet. When the opposite ends meet, you can stick some masking tape on those ends to give you your finished skipping rope like so. 
If you'd like a thicker skipping rope, feel free to use more braids and different colored plastic. That is all for me. Thank you for watching this tutorial.